Good evening, class from Japan. Uh, my name is Sean Clark. I was born and raised in Alaska, and I am married. No kids, but I do have two dogs. Uh, currently, I work for the Air Force. I have been in just a bit over four years now. And as you can tell, that me and my spouse currently live in Japan. We actually live in the outskirts of Tokyo, so we're right in the middle of the hustle and bustle. So it's been pretty exciting so far. Uh, so with the Air Force, it's one of the best decisions I've ever made, and that's not just propaganda. But I started as essentially a basic computer support technician. I was helping people with their trouble tickets, you know, their email wasn't working, they couldn't get to a website, pretty simple things like that. But since then, I've switched to more back-end network maintenance and, maintenance and recovery. So working more with our servers that we use to host our core services um, at the base that I work at. Um, at the moment, though, I am enlisted, but finishing this degree, I will be seeking a commission. Um, I think that I do want to stay within the communications or cyber career fields. <laughs> Um, I'm pretty excited because this is the last class I need to take to complete my degree in computer programming. It has been an interesting, I think, two and a half years now that I've been going to Southwestern College, and I've learned a lot, but I am excited that this part of my life is coming to a close. Um... I took a look at the career services, and it actually looks like a pretty good list. I think that the other learners should especially focus on the sections for resume and cover letters. Um, when looking over those, before joining the military, I worked for AT&T, and I actually helped review um, cover letters and resumes for potential applicants. Um, and a lot of people, they just don't put as much effort that they need to into a resume to properly market them, so it's a skill that people need to learn. Um, I think LinkedIn at the moment is very important because a lot of companies and headhunters use it. And Knox looks to be a super souped up version of LinkedIn. And if it can take off, I think it's actually going to be quite useful. Getting your name, your face, and your information out there is the first step in order for these companies to come and find you. With that being said, I hope that we all learn a lot from each other in this class. And if I'm not the only one where this is your last class until you can get your degree, we made it. <laughs> Um, have a good night.